Hello and welcome to AM Guitar with me, Anjay. Today we are looking at the Karen Basic from Eddie Rifkin Pedals. Some time ago you would have seen me demo the original Karen. This is the stripped back version of Karen. Karen is a boost and saturation pedal, similar in some ways to like a speaker cranker type pedal. It has an active EQ for bass and treble, and it has a little switch here that takes the tone controls out. You have a rage control, which is kind of a volume and distortion um, built into one. We have, uh, what's that one? That one's treble, we have bass, and we have an on-off switch. It's a very simple pedal. I'm gonna take you through some tones with it, just with uh, floorboard here from Maybury. We're going straight into the Carl Martin Ampster, which is a tube pedal, which is what this, uh, a tube amp, which is what this is designed for. And I'm just gonna show you what it does and then talk about it a little bit. Please remember, if you do like this channel or if you're just a new visitor and you're interested uh, to hear more, please do subscribe and hit the, uh, the notification bell as well. Right, let's get on with this. So here is my clean tone. And here is everything at 12 with the tone controls engaged. So instantly you hear a boost, there's a bit more distortion, um, and there is a bit more saturation. I'm going to turn this all the way up. So we're heading into kind of overdrive distortion territory, uh, but very transparent because I'm not doing anything with the EQ. In fact, if I drop the EQ out entirely, so it's not doing a great deal at the moment, but it's an active EQ. So it will shape the tone by taking bass and treble away or adding it. So if I turn everything down, Mostly kind of a, a volume cut, if I put it all up. More of everything. And then I can use it as a tone shaping tool. So I can take some bass out. Uh, no, I can take some bass out, put some treble in. I take the tone controls off. So you can use these controls to really shape your tone. Now, the way I use this is I have that at uh, everything at 12, really. Maybe roll some of the bass off, put some treble in, and I kind of use it like a treble boost, almost like a range master at the start of my signal chain. So this will be my clean signal. And I'll use this to boost the whole of my effects chain and the amp. So I can use the volume control on the guitar to roll out some of the grit. And use it as a kind of a signal booster as well. And that is a really quick run through of the Karen Basic. Now what's really important to think about with this pedal is, it's very easy to just think of it as a joke pedal. You know, it's a bring me the manager, don't take that tone with me, Karen, all this kind of stuff. And it's a stripped back version of the original, there's a bit less happening with it. To kind of dismiss this as a meme is really doing it a disservice. This is, for me, one of the, quite often it's the first thing on my pedal board. 
because I use it like a range master. It is a make better button. It saturates the signal a little bit. It allows me to control the tone a bit, sculpt it, adjust for different guitars. So if I'm using a single coil versus a humbucker, I can dial the rage down a little bit. And it becomes a really, really useful boost and tone control for my, my whole board. So it's not, it's easy to think of it as a joke. It isn't. It's actually a really seriously good pedal. And one that I recommend you look at. Because not only is it a great pedal and it sounds good. It is funny. It does look good. And people do look at the pedal and go, that's brilliant. You know, they love the whole Karen thing. So kudos to Eddie for building these. Thank you to Eddie for sending this one out to me a while back. Sorry it's taken so long to get a demo done for it. If you like this kind of content, as I said before, do like and subscribe, hit the notification bell, comment, tell me what you think about the Karen. Have you seen the Karen X that's been going around on um, Instagram recently? Uh, let me know what you think. And um, yeah, I'll see you again soon. Cheers.